Uh, I'm here in, in Elm Grove in front of the Shriners uh, building. They've been in the news lately because uh, they're having to cut down a very famous tree that's been here for, for, for years and years and years and everybody's kind of upset about it but apparently the, the center of the tree is the only part that's still living and it's becoming a danger to the traffic here so they're uh, in the process of cutting it down. While I was here uh, taking some footage for this video, a uh, few times people drew out, drove past and said, uh, hollered out the windows, you're destroying history and something to that effect. Um, and I was uh, talking to a couple of people here that are from the Sh Shriners building here and they, they were explaining to me that uh, there was a story in the paper a couple of weeks ago that really went in depth on the explanation as to why this tree is coming down and that it's uh, basically it's just become a danger to the traffic here you can see how close that tree is to the uh, to the road and also to the walkway there the, the sidewalk so uh, it, it and basically it's a shame that it's you know it is part of history and it is a, a very old living thing well I found out one thing they sure aren't lying when they say that this battery life is short on this uh, m50 camera anyway what I was in the middle of saying was that while we were while I was out there taking footage people were driving past saying that you're destroying history and all that but but when public safety is involved, you can't cut corners or you can't take chances. Uh, if it's 
that tree fell down on somebody's car or somebody's baby walking on the sidewalk there, uh, they're not going to care about whether it was a historical tree that fell on them. All they're going to care about is uh, how good their insurance is going to be because they're going to get sued because they let a tree fall on some innocent person.